And in case Taiwan gets attacked, what do you think the United Kingdom should do? Um, well, I think it's it's kind of, it's pretty difficult to be honest. But I think hopefully, as part of a larger alliance, we'll be able to take take on the aggressor. So that's my that's my hope. And I think if we weren't to do that, that would just sort of leave the whole of the rest of East Asia open to aggression. So we need to protect it. 各位朋友们，大家好，安安打给呵，我是苏探，欢迎收看这一期的节目。今天我跟我的好朋友路易斯，我们一起到了剑桥大学。剑桥大学呢，它是全英国，应该也是全世界数一数二的大学。那今天我要问剑桥大学附近的人，假如台湾发生三长两短的事情，英国人或是来自其他国家的朋友，觉得要不要帮台湾？那我们今天来调查一下，国际对台湾援助的意愿有多高？好，我们开始吧。Do you know Taiwan? And if you do, what do you know about Taiwan? Um, that it's democratic, as from about 1990. That it's um, like very, it's like quite economically developed. Um, obviously know that it's kind of thought to be threatened as well. Yeah. Wow, you're very knowledgeable. And actually, this is the question I'm going to ask you about. Are you from the UK? Yeah.、Uh, so you know that UK and Taiwan relationships are pretty good. And in case Taiwan is facing an aggression, and in case Taiwan gets attacked, what do you think the United Kingdom should do?、Um, well, I think it's it's kind of, it's pretty difficult to be honest. But I think hopefully, as part of a larger alliance, we'll be able to take take on the aggressor. So that's my that's my hope, and I think if we weren't to do that, that would just sort of leave the whole of the rest of East Asia open to aggression. So we need to protect it, but ideally we need to get stuff there very very quickly. And the UK is not going to have the ability to do that ourselves really at all. Like I see us more in terms of like in the intelligence area maybe, and some. Maybe some, our nuclear submarines could have some, not not the ones with the nukes on, but the attack submarines could have some benefit. But other than that, I don't think we can project power very well there ourselves. But you see the UK as a part of a larger alliance to protect Taiwan. Yes. Yeah. Okay.、Right. We need an East NATO. We need, basically need an Eastern NATO. That's what we need. Wow. Thank you so much. <laughs> thank you. Thanks a lot. Thank have a good one. Wow. 第一个人就对台湾那么的有了解，超棒的。哦、oh, ，那不愧是就是在这里培养的人，就是英国跟应该是全世界的未来。在 ，OK。Do you know Taiwan? Yes. What do you know about Taiwan? It's beside China. OK. And what do, do you know that right now Taiwan is being threatened, right? Yes. What do you think the United Kingdom should do if Taiwan gets attacked? I have no idea. You asked the wrong person. I don't live here. OK. <laughs> but where are you from then? I'm from Northern Ireland, but I live in Austria. Okay, then what do you think the European Union, as you live in Austria, should do to protect Taiwan, and if they should do anything to protect Taiwan? I, honestly, I have no、um, input in this. <laughs> Wrong person to ask. Okay, still,、Sorry. thank you so much. <laughs> have a good one. We are planning on taking points to Taiwan. Oczywiście. Oczywiście. I co pani o tym państwie myśli?、Uh, co myślę? No wystarczy zobaczyć jak wygląda.、Uh, no tak, no dobrze. Przepiękne miejsce, bo jestem turystką, także、dobrze. uwielbiam, wiesz, uwielbiam oglądać różne、e, portale, YouTube'a, oglądam różnych YouTuberów, którzy jeżdżą sobie po świecie, no i tam jest pięknie. I czy wie pani, że teraz、Moje、jest takie zagrożenie ze strony Chin? No i jest. I co pani、Zawsze、o tym、było. myśli? Co pani o tym myśli? Wesprzeć może tak, ale zrobić to chyba nic się nie da. Ale jak wesprzeć? Jacy jesteśmy? My jesteśmy, wiesz, tylko pioneczkiem. My nie damy rady nic. No jesteśmy częścią、możemy、Unii tylko... Europejskiej. No, no to możemy finansowo pomóc, no ale wiesz, chyba sami na razie potrzebujemy pomocy. No to się zgadzam, ale możemy. <laughs> możemy, oczywiście. No dobrze. I warto. No i jeżeli, warto, jeżeli, oczywiście. Jeżeli, jeżeli, jeżeli potrzebują. Jeżeli, jeżeli możemy po... Wiesz, Ukrainie, to możemy i wszystkim, Panowie, wszystkim pomagamy. Nam kiedyś、tak. też pomagali. Wiesz, ja jestem z tych czasów Solidarności, więc、e, pamiętam te czasy. Więc teraz mi trochę szkoda tego czasu, który nadszedł, ale, ale tak, ale powinno się pomagać. Kto, poma- kto potrzebuje, to się powinno pomagać, wiesz, nie myśląc o tym, żeby nam to oddali, nie? No właśnie. No właśnie. Nie ma wolności bez Solidarności przecież. Nie ma. Dokładnie.、Tak. Dobrze powiedziane. Dobrze powiedziane. Dziękuję uprzejmie. Do zobaczenia. Pa pa. Do you know that Taiwan is currently being threatened by China?、Uh, yes, vaguely. Like I've heard about it. 
And what do you think the United Kingdom and Taiwanese allies should do in case of an attack? Um, I suppose work together to try and help each other, support each other. Thank you. Thank you so much. You're from the UK, right? Yes. Um, do you know that Taiwan is currently being threatened? Yeah, I do. Yeah. And what do you think the United Kingdom should do in case Taiwan gets attacked? I think it's really difficult because you don't want to end up like in a World War III situation, as that would be really sad. But we want to like stand up for them and we've committed to standing up for them. So I like you can always have sanctions, but sanctions don't work very well. So like you could put a strongly worded letter online. That might help. Huh? Are you are you <laughs> is that kind of British humour or <laughs> very much British humour. <laughs> because I don't know what realistically we can do and it's really sad that we're in that position. Though we're so reliant on China for so much that we don't really have an option. And that's why it feels like so much of the diplomacy that we're doing at the moment is counterproductive because everyone knows that we couldn't do anything if it came to that point. Well, but Europe was pretty um, reliant on the Russian oil and gas and still we managed somehow. Yeah, when Europe's still reliant on Russian oil and gas, it's just going via third party people. So pretending that we're not, like, yeah. It's kind of just an idea, but has it really helped in Ukraine? How about military support? Do you think that the UK should provide some vessels, submarines, weaponry? I think if we were going to do that, we'd have to go via a third party, as I don't think the UK is in a position where we want to be going directly into a proxy war with China. But I think that potentially going via some third party dealers, that would work, yeah. Okay, thank you so much. Thank you. Have a good one. Yes. And they're also quite important for the microchip industry. Oh yeah, you know a lot. Are you from, where are you from? I'm from Italy. From Italy. And what do you think Italy and European Union, probably NATO countries, should do in case Taiwan gets attacked? Oh, that's actually hard to say because the consequences can be quite big. You don't want a, you don't want a world war with China involved, obviously, but at the same time, I do believe a country has the right to defend itself. Same goes for Ukraine, for example. So I do, maybe I don't think they should be involved in defending it, but probably helping like they're doing with Ukraine, maybe it could be like a middle ground. I don't know, it's actually obviously very complicated geopolitics there. But it's at, quite hard to handle. But at least the country should stand up and provide some support. Obviously, 100% for me. Thank you so much. No Thank you. Have a good one. Bye-bye. Do you know that Taiwan is being threatened currently by China? Yes. Uh, you are from the United Kingdom. Yes. What do you think the United Kingdom should do if Taiwan gets attacked? I think we've got enough problems of our own to deal with. So don't interfere. Far away and don't interfere. You know, we don't know the way people live there, and so therefore, personally, I just feel you know we have got to sneak up on you. You do. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I need to say any more. Okay. <laughs> thank you. Thank and you have the same opinion? Yes. yes. Yeah. yeah. Okay, thank you. It's a place that's in dispute. It's a piece of land where people live who China thinks belongs to them, and but actually the people there choose to believe they don't. Okay. Am I vaguely right? <laughs> you are absolutely right. And what do you think, as right now China is actually threatening Taiwan, right? Yeah. What do you think? You're from the United Kingdom, right? Yes. Yeah. What do you think the United Kingdom should do in case Taiwan gets attacked? It's complicated, isn't it? Yeah. Because obviously we have probably a really large diaspora here that's from Taiwan, so we have some accountability towards those people. Um, but at the same time, that's a state that needs to be governed in whatever way they choose to be governed. So I think if the UK was to intervene, it would have to be at the invitation of people in Taiwan, right? Like We couldn't just be like, hey, we're going to come and save you. but. You know, I, sh I don't think we should ever sit back when people are being persecuted. Thank you so much. That's a very good answer. Have a good one. Okay, so what do you think the United Kingdom should do in case Taiwan gets attacked? Oh, uh, probably depends on their international policy. I don't know what our relationship is with Taiwan. Oh. But personally, as a citizen? Oh, um, I think if China is bullying any country, it would be nice if the United Kingdom could step in. But I also realize that that might put our own country and our own citizens at risk going up against China. Um, and also, because we're linked to NATO, we wouldn't want to take in a bunch of other countries with us. So, yeah. yeah. Thank you so much. It was a very good answer. Thank Have you. a good one. But uh, you know about the existence of Taiwan, right? Of what else do you know about it? Well, not an awful lot, to be honest. I um, don't know what you want me to say about it. I can't say a lot if I don't know it. I know it's a country that seems to have a successful economy quite well, I think, and a yeah. uh, happy population, as far as I know. 
Well, you're pretty well informed. And do you know that Taiwan has an issue with a neighboring country? I've heard about it. Don't ask me to go into detail. But, I, you know, there's so much trouble in the world all around every place. It's hard yeah. to take it all on board. So. An educated guess. You're from the United Kingdom, right? Correct. Uh, what do you think the United Kingdom should do in case Taiwan gets attacked and needs help? Ah, good question. I think we have a, an obligation to protect all people from whatever nation if they're being overtaken by an aggressor. Uh, I think we have uh, we all have that duty in the world. But then that's happening as we see in uh, in so many countries. Hmm? I'm not aware you need something. <laughs> well, I don't think we do. But uh, but having said that, I think we we yeah we have a we have a responsibility uh, to look after people in those situations and countries that are uh, free democracies and uh, 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 have an ability to survive on their own. Thank you so much. It was a very good answer. Have a wonderful day. It was great. It was great. It was great. Thank you so much. Do you guys know Taiwan? Taiwan? Yeah. Yes. What do you know about it? Uh, it's got beef with China. Oh yeah, that's exactly the question I'm going to ask you. You're from here, right? From the UK? Yes. What do you think the United Kingdom should do in case Taiwan needs help and it's being attacked? Help them out, you know. Do you think that <laughs> democracies should stand together? Yeah. If an ally needs, you know, yeah, help in hand. They, they send us lots of computer chips from Taiwan. They do. And I Almost all like, of them. <laughs> and I quite like my phone. So yeah. I reckon you'd get more people on side than Ukraine if you tell them they're going to lose their phones if we don't send the army. So let's do that. Okay, that's Cheers. a good answer. Cheers. Thank you so much. Have a good one. Taiwan, yeah. 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 And uh, what do you know about it? Um, I know it's an island in the, um, in, in the, yeah, the Pacific Ocean, South China Sea, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Nice. And do you know that Taiwan is currently being threatened by a neighboring country, right? Yeah, yeah, I'm aware of that. And what do you, you're from the United Kingdom. I'm from Ireland. You're from Ireland. What do you think Ireland should do in case Taiwan is being attacked? My Ireland isn't a part of NATO. I, I think when any country faces aggression uh, from like a, a bigger, imposing country, uh, you know, uh, we, we we should support them, uh, like support their people whatever way they can. Uh, there are links between industries in Taiwan and in Ireland, so like there are connections there. So yeah, I think. Uh, we are a neutral country, but I still think we need to stand by and support them like we have done with Ukraine. <coughs> that was a very good answer. Thank you so much. Thank you. Have a good one. Uh, you guys are from here, from the UK? Yes. What do you think the United Kingdom should do in case Taiwan is being attacked? I don't know. They're not they're very good at doing things. Well, for example, Ukraine got attacked. It. Yeah. And its people. Yeah. Yes. Thank you. It's a very good answer. <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> Sounds like a true question, but no, 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 that, 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 that's, that's all it is. Because yeah. currently there are a lot of news that China is saying, oh, Taiwan is a part of our country. Their military doctrine includes like they can invade militarily. Like Ukraine yeah. and the, the Ukraine. And Russia. Yeah, yeah, that's pretty similar. Yeah. And that's why I'm asking people like, what should the UK do or what should the countries they come from do in case Taiwan is being invaded? Yeah, that's it. Thank you. Have a good one. For the UK, you know, the UK people still need their phones and computers to function, right? Yes, we do. Yeah, we, That's we, why we, Taiwan we, is very important. True. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, true. Yeah. So if you look at from the more like egocentric point of view, mm -hmm. it's kind of also crucial. Yeah. Without Taiwan, the UK would have it harder. Yeah. Honestly. We'd have to find another way to have things manufactured for sure. Won't be easy to do that like in at because least 10 years or 20 years. Yeah, because of the road we've gone down in the past, yeah. This, the, these are really deep questions that I don't yeah. think you and I have a hope in hell of changing. Well, but you're a citizen, you have your vote, right? And you can still impact to a certain extent policies of your country, so... Yes. Well, yeah, I mean, yeah, we, we, we influence Brexit, so... <laughs> <laughs> Unfortunately. <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, you, you also have a right to do, like, to make stupid decisions and, you yeah, know... <laughs> absolutely, yeah, yeah. Well, we don't, we don't even need to do that. We have politicians who can make uh, stupid yeah, decisions. Yeah, anyway, yeah, unfortunately. Well, thanks very much for uh, asking well, the questions. I don't know well, thank you for answering. I don't know if it's made any uh, impact on, on the conversation. Well, of course it does. Yeah. Of course it does. Thank you. Okay, thank you take care. Have a good day. 拜拜。那各位看，在这里有非常多的来自各地的朋友，而且感觉上大部分的人都是还蛮支持台湾的。虽然有一些会有一些心理素嘛，会有一些考量，但是一天到民主国家被恐吓、被威胁，就会觉得这是另外一个民主国家的责任，就是要帮助他。所以，哎，要团结起来。感谢大家，下次见，拜拜。